Here's my exam server. I've booted up Apache and MySQL. And over here I have PHP my admin. If you look over here, I have two databases on the top. I'm going to insert another one right over here. In order to do that, I'm going to use Python. So the first thing I'm going to do is I import MySQL.connector so I can connect Python to MySQL. I hit enter. No errors. MySQL.connector says yes. I want you to connect to the server. The name of the host you'll be connecting to is localhost. You're going to connect as user root. And your password will be blank. Assign this entire connection to the variable con. And I hit enter. No error. The next thing I key in is con. This is yes. I want you to make a cursor. Cursor is an area in memory where system will put its records so that it can easily traverse those records. And I want you to assign all of that to the letter M, the variable M. M will be my manager. He will manage this cursor. I hit enter. No errors. Mr. M? Yes. I want you to execute the following SQL statement. Create database DB2015. And I hit enter. No errors. That means that M just created a database in my system called DB2015. Well, really, did he do that? How can we be sure? Let's go and test. So I go to PHP, my admin. I don't see DB2015 at all. So I hit the F5 key to refresh the system. And bingo, there it is, DB2015. Let's click on that plus. Nothing is displayed. That means it is empty. Okay, let's now go back to our code. M, I want you to execute the following command. Use DB2015. And I hit enter. No errors. So it's now using DB2015. Whatever I do will affect DB2015. M, I want you to execute a very lengthy and complex command that will span and traverse multiple lines. Because of that, I don't want to use the standard double quotes. I'm going to put in triple quotes. It will accept any formatting that I use. So I key in triple doubles, and then my command, create a table called customer, C-U-S-T, cust. So M, execute, triple doubles, create table cust. And then I hit the Enter key a few times so that you can see this more easily. Then I go back up over to here. And I key in open parentheses. So far what I've done is I told M to execute this command within triple double quotes. Create table cust. Now I open parens and I'm going to define the table called cust. It will have an ID field of type integer and it will be the primary key. The next field will be FN, first name. It'll be of type verchar, 12 characters max for this field, comma. The next variable will be LN, last name. It will be of type verchar, 15 characters max. Okay, that's it. Now I want to end this table definition. So how do I end this? Well, I'm going to have to key in close parentheses here to match this open parentheses here. And then I'm going to have to key in the matching triple double quotes and then a matching close parens for this open parens over here. And then I think I'm good to go. Okay, I'm going to hit the enter key now. And no errors. Did that work? Did it really create a table called cust? Let's put it to the test and go find out. I go to PHP my admin. I click on the plus next to DB2015. And ooh la la, there's my cust table. I click on its plus sign and I see columns and indices. I click on the plus sign next to columns and there they are. First name, last name, and ID. 
In fact, if you go over to the right-hand side and click on the SQL tab and key in the command describe db2015.cust semicolon and then click on go, you get this screen. Here's your MySQL command describe db2015.cust and that's talking about describing the structure of this table. So here's your SQL command. Here's your three fields, ID, first name, and last name. Here's the data types of those three fields, int and verchar. Here you can see that ID is the primary key. And don't forget to close your database at the very end, con.close. Open close friends. And all that was done by this code. In the next video, I'll populate db2015.cust with data. If you found this video helpful, please click on the like button below. I'd appreciate that. Logically yours, this is George Bull.